All right, what's going on, guys? Your boy Jay Mingos here, and we are playing some Sebastian Loeb Rally Evo. Uh, this game actually just dropped today in the UK. It does not come to America until about March. But uh, first setting we do have here is that we have to create our team. Uh, let's go ahead and check out our team members here. So driver name, we're going to put Jay Mingos in here. Really excited for this game. I actually uh, enjoy rally racing games. Like the last one I did play was WRC5, which is really fun in my opinion. But I'm really excited for this game as well. I thank uh, Milestone PR for uh, giving me a review copy of this game here. And let's go ahead and check out. Let's go ahead and get our number here. And basically, we are creating our team right now. We're going to leave all that there. Don't really know what to change. Uh, we just did this. All right, so suit and helmet. Let's go ahead and get uh, a nice color going here. All right, so we're just gonna keep it black and then change up our helmet to something fly. I like this right here. All right, and last but not least, our team information, we are going to call it uh, YouTube squad, I guess. <laughs> Racing, yeah, I like that. All right, so font we're gonna put it font five. Going to change up the colors here. We're gonna make it green, yellow, and black. All right, I like that. All right, so let's go ahead and hit confirm and see what the menus look like, what the racing's like, all that good stuff. Let's go ahead and hear what he has to say real fast. Setting up your team's headquarters in an old quarry was a great idea. Here you have everything you need to test drive your cars and train in preparation for the rallies. The upper part of the area is dedicated to asphalt tracks, the lower part to dirt roads. Your adventures as a professional driver start here. All you've got to do now is show you've got what it takes. All right, so first off, it says, have I ever played a rally game? Um, I have, but I do want to try out the tutorial mode here and make sure that I can get this racing down pat. It's always good to start off with the tutorial mode. Now, I believe this game is retailing for about 50 to 60 American dollars. I'm not too sure what that is in the UK pricing, but like I said earlier, it's not going to be available. First, let's see how you get on with the basics. Drive to the point indicated. All right, time for tutorial. When you find yourself near a training circuit, you can instantly start a timed session by pressing the appropriate button. These sessions are extremely useful for putting a car's performance to the test or for improving your skills behind the wheel. Try and complete three laps of the circuit in the shortest time possible and without hitting the cones. Three, two, one, go. When you have to perform a U-turn or go round a hairpin bend, you can use the handbrake. Try to perform a handbrake turn on the next corner. Thank <laughs> you. 
you'll get more experience the more you drive, and you'll be able to set even faster times. Now you can drive freely throughout the training area, including the quarry. Just like on the asphalt track, you can do timed training sessions on the dirt track as well. extremely demanding discipline both physically and mentally all right so all right so to start off <laughs> the uh, driving in this game is a lot different from like your average need for speed or like WRC 5 or just your average racing game it's a lot the handbrakes a lot harder to get used to uh, braking is a lot harder turning is a lot uh, stiffer but when you actually turn then you'll lose control it's a little weird I have to go tweak a little bit of the settings here but we're gonna try and hop into our first rally uh, competition and see what we can do uh, training wasn't as successful but we're gonna go ahead and try it out and see what we can do let's go all right so we have unlocked this car right here and let's see if we can just do one quick race for you guys and uh, then I'll be bringing you guys some career mode um, videos. But just real quick, let's go ahead and take a look at the main menus. We got quick mode, career, lobe. Uh, I don't know how to say it. Is it lobe or lua? I don't know. Experience. We got garage. We got Xbox Live, which is most anticipated mode, Xbox Live. Then we have options here. Uh, we have test drive and downloadable content which uh, let's go ahead and check out and see if there is any downloadable content as of right now since the game just did come out um, and I am on the US market right now so there's probably nothing in the US market it's probably all in the UK market but I actually see something right here let's go ahead and check it out see it's not available till March 15th for us but I'll go ahead and have to check that out on the UK market after but let's go ahead and just hop into a quick race here uh, let's go ahead and do a time trial and see if we can do well on it. Let's go on Pike's Peak. And hope you guys do enjoy this video. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys can, just leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And look forward to some career mode. And I'll see you guys when I see you guys. Peace. A key element of your eventual success on the track is decided in the service park. You can modify your car's setup here and check information about the upcoming stages. Three, two, one, go.